I've got a box and I'm not afraid to open it. Yay! Plant haul! This is the first time I bought from the seller on Facebook. Locarno Plant Nursery! Yay! Jan Satori is the one who's selling these beautiful plants and I've been hovering, stalking her page for a while now, just waiting and looking to see if it's a scammer or <laughs> a legit seller. And she is very legit and very, very easy to deal with. And she's got beautiful plants. So in this video, we're doing some unboxing. Hello there, my name is Liz, a self-confessed succulent addict Welcome to my channel, Growing Succulents. She actually sells a lot of packs. So is buying succulents in packs worth it rather than buying it in single individual piece? Let's find out. I actually bought a pack of... Are you in you? Oh my goodness, hang on just to make sure that the label's still there. Oh, wow, look at this. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna go. So first, I got the Yonium in a pack of 10. So this is ink painting, and she gives you a, a couple of freebies as well. So, oh, that is quite big, isn't it? So these are cuttings, because at the moment, they're supposed to be a slip they're still hibernating or dormant <laughs> hibernating. Okay, what is this one? Chanel. Okay, I got a tiny Chanel here. So that's part of the pack. So you get 10 different variety of Ionium in a pack. And she has different packs all the time. So it's up to you which one you're going to choose. But, so this is Red King Kong. And they're quite big plants. And that one Medusa, I already have a Medusa. I only have actually two. So this would make it three Medusa. Do I have three or four? Sorry, I've got three. So this is the fourth one. Now this one is Shurong. Shurite, Shurong. <laughs> I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, something's missing. Anyway, this one is Pink Daisy, I think this is the freebies. I don't know what this is, a cutting of something. I think this is, might be a freebie or whatever. Anyway, gift, it is, oh. Echeveria, Peach Pride, there you go. So Peach Pride, that's a gift. Cutting, excellent. And that one is Superbang, yay. Okay, I'm not gonna remove the label because or else I'm gonna lose them. Now, that one is, I don't know, uh, this one, yeah, face powder. So, she gave me two face powder. Excellent. Now, <laughs> now that one, variegated. Oh, lovely rose. <gasps> variegated, lovely rose. Yes, I got one. Finally, isn't she beautiful? How cute! So please don't die on me. Put it this way, this is the cheapest I've seen them. So others are more expensive and if there's some cheaper ones, I seem to be missing out all the time. I'm a bit too late. Not too expensive. I'm not going to say how much it is because it all depends on the size. So this one is more on the cheaper side compared to the expensive side. So if she gets bigger plants, then of course the price, or should I say her prices, is actually according to the size of the plant. There you go, lovely rose. And then this one, I have been eyeing this for a long time. I have one of this plant and I just love it. I love, love, love this plant. So when I saw this cluster, I actually stalked this for a while. So this is from last year. I don't think anyone would uh, want to buy this because it's a cluster. And if you're buying a cluster, it works out like really expensive because you're not buying just one plant and yet people pay twenty dollars for one plant which i did before for just one head and this one is okay this is echeveria mia and i just love this plant so the good thing about locarno plant nursery is that since she has packs and also she's got 
say cluster like this you can get together with your friends or Facebook groups instead of just buying one plant you buy a cluster and then you split it up amongst yourselves and then it works out cheaper so anyway what's your label there you go I'll put that there but I'll never forget your name anyway now the next one is okay pink witch I already have a pink witch I got a few pink witch but unfortunately this is part of the pack I tried asking for her to swap it with something else but she said unfortunately it's all in a pack so I have to take it but it doesn't matter it's still a bargain but I am really uh, happy with the, uh, the sizes of these plants because sometimes it's really hard buying something this one is immortal ink this one I have to buy separately this did not come with a pack but I wanted it and if you want it you gotta pay for it this is called Echeveria Sarang and variegated plant so I think it looks very similar to those uh, Mickey Mouse or something like that but this one's so I just want a cluster and I got a good price for this cluster and then last but not least she gave me gift a super rose I asked her first if she doesn't know who I am <laughs> to her I'm just <laughs> and she doesn't know that I plan to do an unboxing video when she sent me the um, tracking number that's when I sent her a message saying who I am because I use a different name on Facebook I'm uh, incognito now <laughs> I told her that I do YouTube videos and this is my channel and I'm gonna be doing an unboxing and she says thank you very very much but she gave me this after asking her if she has a super rose for sale so anyway this is a cutting as well freshly cut so it's all dried up and quite a big plant look at that so I've just finished familiarizing myself with my new beautiful babies I love 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 them but anywho now I've got my super rose and that's the pot I'm gonna put that in and my immortal ink my immortal ink beautiful ionium immortal ink and of course you can see the mia in the background there and also the sarang i don't know whether it's a sedum or a chivria but i believe it could possibly be a sedivaria now this gift of variegated <laughs> i forgot peach pride yes the peach pride is gonna go in this yellow pot and okay i just put this down before i knock it now with my other ioniums here i have just familiarized myself with them and i put them next to each other so let's go have a close look first off this one is red king kong medusa and that one is sisha fairy so the fairy medusa king kong and also what are you forgot your name now Shurong. So this one is kind of sort of similar looking. Also, this one is, oh my goodness, Juana. So Juana here is sort of kind of looks very similar shape to the Medusa. But also you can say the Shurong. But they still have some differences. King Kong and Sisha Fairy. Sisha Fairy has got a black tips and pointy. So see the black tips on those ones? And then King Kong here also got black tips, but it's sort of smaller. After a while, I'm sure I won't be able to tell. But I think, I believe <laughs> this one could possibly, the red King Kong do grow big. So it's going to be confusing when they do grow, whether which is which. So very, very slight differences so anyway this one now what are you your pink daisy so this little pink daisy is so delicate sorry do i have the pink yes that's a pink daisy that's a freebie now the super bang you might think that that's very similar to the other one but it's very distinct in the sense that they have those yellow edges and quite broad the red in the center is actually more maroon than red whereas the king kong over here has got sort of a pink tone or magenta on the edge as sort of darks gets darker as it gets uh, to 
the edges of the leaves. Green lemon here is very distinct on its own, so it doesn't look like any of the ones I've got here. And of course, the pink witch just stands out like dog's balls. <laughs> <laughs> There's a saying, that's a saying. I'm not being rude, but anyway, so this one's now, I forgot what this one is now. Okay, so this is ink painting. Now this ink painting, look, there's a got little stain, <laughs> pink stain in the center. This Chanel has got a darker middle part and this actually, the mother plant or the bigger plant of a Chanel is just spectacular as well. This is my pack that I got from her and she sells different packs as well so it's up to you uh, which pack you're gonna get but this is the pack I end up with. And she also sells a lot of variegated plants and also I've already costed out all of these. So I paid 165 for 12 plants so that's 10 plants plus two free plants so if I go by her page if she sells them individually this pack here would have cost me 280 so I save 115 by buying this pack so this ones these are the individual prices so it works out at $13.75 a plant and they're quite big plants. It took me a long time to think about it and so finally I work out that it's actually much cheaper to buy it this way since I don't have most of the plants that I've got here except a couple of them. So the pink witch here I don't really need to get more of this because I got a lot of pink witch but this is something I can pot up and grow again and maybe sell as well and get my money back and the rest of them I can just pot them up, grow them and hopefully by next year I would have at least two plants from each variety. So anyway guys that's all I've got for this video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing of this beautiful Ioniums and also a couple of variegated plants. So is it worth buying in packs? Definitely. Most definitely.